We're back in Supermarket Simulator. Yay! This is a nice, chill way to uh, end the evening. Should we have music? So what should we listen to? Mm, electronica, maybe? Okay. So for those who weren't here for... Thursday's stream? Yes, Thursday's stream. We were playing Supermarket Simulator. It is a game. Where you stock a supermarket and you sell things. Basically what you'd expect. It is a very, very nice and chill game. So I figured it'd be nice to play some of this just to end the night. Checking all my prices. There we go. We're good. We have almost no money. So we're probably done stocking for the night. Unless I can buy more flour. I can buy more flour. Oh, I already was planning to buy more flour. <gasps> no! Oh no! We had a giant pile of boxes in the road, and they're gone! My box fort's gone! That's so rude! Aww, we spent so long building that! Also, what is this? Just a random salt box in the middle of the road? That's really strange. I guess the moral of the story is that you can throw boxes in the road as much as you want, and no one will ever complain. Okay, this music is just too much right now. And we're just having a chill supermarket. Store level 12. That means something. <laughs> My objective is to purchase a fridge or shelf. I have purchased a lot of shelves. I don't know why that's a thing. Hold on a second. I need to move. Can I move these or is the wrong size box? <sighs> Oh, this is my chill game. I wish I could play this not on stream, but the problem is there's only one save slot, and I don't want to mess with the game. People buy some really, like, crazy amounts of stuff. They bought a lot of peanut butter with that spaghetti. They just bought four bags of flour. Why?
Who needs four bags of flour? What are you making? <laughs> Oh, this is this is the perfect relaxing game, I gotta say. I'm really having fun playing Path again. It makes me happy. But also, my brain can only handle so much. And rather than just ending the stream, I also want to play this on stream too, still. So it just seems to make sense to transition to this if I'm too tired for Path. Because, like, I want to be able to do cool path things and not just map constantly. I mean, I will map a ton, but I do kind of want to do, like, the special stuff with y'all. That is always my impetus, though. Oh, oh my gosh. Who needs three salt? Three separate salt shakers. That is ridiculous. Other people have come in. They, like, this guy looks like a caterer. But some of the people who came in before looked like they'd gone to a wedding. I'm, like, imagining there's just, like, a wedding nearby. And all of the people are just leaving from their jobs or wedding prison and are it's like I need food I need sustenance for all the weird wedding stuff I dealt with I've never actually been to a wedding <laughs> they just they just don't seem very fun for the most part maybe for the person whose wedding it is but they seem just kind of annoying this is me, though. I guess maybe if I was celebrating someone I really cared about, it'd be different. I'm making bank today. Fifty for five dollars, seriously? Reminds me. I need to get my auto click in case I need Cool, I think it started. Yes, it did. Okay, cool. I might need that for some. We'll see. I like just being able to click really fast on the thing. On. You may be surprised to find I don't care that you're waiting. I'm gonna get the boxes out of my store. No! Oh! Oh, thank you. Thank you, yep, I appreciate that. Still can't believe they took our box board away. City's so mean. I just built a lovely box fort for them and maybe in the middle of the road and they just couldn't appreciate it like what type of what type of people just can't appreciate a good box for it like are you really even a human anymore you don't have the base box fort desire
That is one of the great things about having either children or dogs. You can make them box for Or you can make a box for it for them. In air quotes. <laughs> and then you can play in it. I like to I like to try and build box forts for Romeo, my big pupper. Because he eats just about everything that I give him. Like he destroys everything. So I can't really like make anything that lasts for him, unfortunately. Um so like I just take the uh, cardboard boxes that I've given him to rip up, because he likes doing that, and I use that to make, I use the remainders, like the flat pieces of cardboard that he's left alone to make actual uh, Oxford stuff. Then he has a cool spot to sleep. Sure, if that little bastard didn't eat everything, including the things that are not edible, it would be so much easier. Salt sliced bread, past spaghetti. And keep that. Nice bread, five. Spaghetti. Spaghetti, spaghetti. Seven. I just round up to the. I just round up or down to the closest uh, whole number. If he didn't destroy everything I give him, I would very much love to like have him have a actual fucking dog bed, but that's just not reasonable. I wish it was. It just isn't reasonable. They'll expect that he can have a dog bed and it will last for more than like. Six hours. Honestly, six hours is pretty generous. There are, like, some, like, really expensive Kevlar beds that you can get for your dogs. And those probably would be okay for him. He had a Kevlar toy once, and it lasted for a month. Which might not sound like much, but to me, that's, like, an obscenely long time for a toy of his to last. A week is a very long time for a toy of his to last. Nonetheless, that long. Olive oil. Flour. Or flour. Two peanut butter. Two spaghetti. I have enough basmati. I need two chocolate pick. Okay, I need one susu and three penne. I didn't notice before it says penne on it. I need two canola. Two master flower. We have master flower and supreme flower. And we need all the sliced bread that can possibly fit into the store. One, two. Oh, wait. No, not that. Oh, charcoal pick. Uh oh, I might have bought extra charcoal pick accidentally. I charcoal picked too much up. Now that I'm in like calm mode. My brain is more able to, uh, chat, I think, now. I've had quite an interesting day. I've had a bunch of paperwork to fill out for a job. I 
And I've been reminded that medical services suck everywhere. As I spent... I don't know how many hours today, and between today and yesterday, just trying to find out the hours of a walk-in clinic nearby. Like, I found a page that references them. They're like, oh, go to the website and there'll be more information. There's just no website. I, I, I check on the actual page that references it for, like, the hours. No, it's so uh, you have to call to get the hours. But the problem is if you call, you can't get a human on the phone. It's just like, oh, just leave a message and we'll call you back at some point. Except for I did that a while ago. And... That was a week and a half ago, and guess what hasn't happened? Until this afternoon, when I called them... I don't know how many times I called them, because I had to... I can just... I, I... Don't you hate it when... When companies, and for... I don't even blame the people who work there for this, because this is totally... Totally not their fault that this system's stupid. But... I would get a... Uh, a number to call for like oh this is the number that you call for the clinic and then i call that number and they'd be like oh no 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 you want you want the other building uh you call this number i'm like okay i'll call this number then i call it no 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 wrong building you want the other building no you're across the road now i'm like no what what no okay they're like okay try either this or this okay well i'll try the first one machine immediately hangs up on me and all I heard here is the word you, and I could swear, I know this is not the case, I know it's not, but I could swear that the the machine said fuck you and hung up on me. <laughs> and after going through like three or four different places where I was not trying to go, I finally, finally went back to the very first thing I tried. And somehow managed to get a call back from them after, like, for fucking ever waiting for them to actually do stuff. Oh my gosh, it is such a nightmare to try to organize things with doctor's offices and stuff. It's been, like, my frustration all day is just playing phone tag with different parts of a different parts and buildings of the same area one of which is supposed to be the right thing the like right thing and none of or sorry all of which are supposed to be the right thing and none of which are my gosh that was most of my day today Well, let's drive through it. Oh yeah, I got the storage. I forgot about that. I should put storage stuff in there. I also need more susu. Need more susu and more spaghetti. And more olive oil. Do... Get a olive oil. Yes, I want furniture. I want the racks for the storage room. All rack. All rack. All rack. <laughs> Let's see if this works. Ah, oh, yes, the perfect way to stack this. Have a rack. Very green. Didn't expect it to be so green. Did I do that myself? I probably could have colored it. I wasn't paying any attention to that. All rack. Nope, there's no color on it because the color is at the under the unit price usually. Okay, well that worked, I guess. I guess we'll just buy another one. And I have more rack. Rack city. Rack. 
City. City bitch. Wreck, wreck, city. Wait, they're changing colors. Oh my gosh, I have mood shelving. Oh, what the fuck? It changed color again. Hi, Oxman. Welcome to the stream. Playing more supermarket simulator. Running the supermarket into the ground. No, it's probably going to go okay. Okay, that worked. At some point, I'm going to need restockers. And that's what these sto the storage room is for, really. Yeah, the town took away my box fort. I was really despondent. This was gone. I guess it's useful that, that it goes away, but... I'm honestly just sad. I want my box for it. I wanted to make it bigger. And bigger. And bigger. And bigger. <laughs> uh. Oh, I need to open this door. Nah, it's not that realistic. I, I, I'm guessing what happened is that, uh, based on game logic, there are uh, temporary entities that aren't saved. Uh, by the game when you save. So when I loaded the save, or when I closed the game, it just discarded any temporary entities, and the it just reloaded the things that were actually saved when I saved. It just doesn't reload empty boxes. Which I guess makes sense. It's just unfortunate. Yay, my first customer. Tell me he doesn't look like a limo driver. Oh, oh, there's more of him. Friend, your brother just left. Guess so. At least strange, if nothing else. I hope that the sounds in my background are not coming through my mic. Otherwise, I'm about to close the window. I opened the window for some air. That might have been an error. Those two identical men just came out of that door. No, just a car in the idling in the driveway beside mine. It's a bit late for construction. $364. I want to get a restocker. I think it's time. 
Those skills are nothing. Growth. Hiring. Oh, requires store level 50. Hiring cost. I don't really want to do that, though. Maybe purchasing a fridge or shelf is required to level up the mark. I'm not going to get a fridge because I don't need them. $100 bill for $9 stuff. Not as bad as, like, of the pack of gum for $100. you. Radioactive man. Maybe I just need to keep checking out customers to level up my store. Oh, yes. I just saw uh, door points or whatever. Yeah. yeah you, okay, yeah. You get stuff when you... When you Uh, when you check people out. Okay, well, I guess I'm just gonna have to keep checking people out. And you have to do this for quite a while before you doctor. What I thought it'd just be like when you can afford it. It's not. Oh my gosh, they're just demolishing my flower for some reason. Why does everyone want flour? Most people don't use flour for things. Okay, most people in the city don't use flour for things. Maybe. Yeah, I guess holiday baking does, and some people do actually like cooking. Me. Not hungry. This one really needs flour. Everyone needs flour. <laughs> the peanut butter. Probably four red flour. Definitely an olive oil. Definitely a basmati. Choco pick. Oh, the maximum. Those, oh, I can't put an order in yet. Okay. I need to check all these people out. Day 16. Slice bread went down, peanut butter went up. Oh, peanut butter went up a lot. 
Sliced bread is still... I don't know. It's down to four. Giant tower of bread. Oh, I have such an angry bug. Only I knew what she wanted. I don't want a corner here. I also kind of don't want to have to deal with a corner there. I mean, put it back down. Bring it out. Let me, let me place it. Let me place it. Let me place it. Thank you. Nothing's wrong. You're wrong. Face is wrong. I don't know who I'm arguing. The only one here. Ooh. Well, if you make the rules in the argument, you're the one who can win. Unless the other you cheats. Hard to see that coming. So are these both partially filled boxes then? Oh, just gonna keep two partially closed boxes together? For separate? Okay, whatever. Oh. Oh, not that. Damn it, why is the rack full? The rack should not be full. Fine. They full box. No, I keep doing that. Okay, full box. Full box. Partial box. Why did I buy so much chocolate pick? What is wrong with me? Oh, okay, you're going over there. I have no more space. If I keep buying so much chocolate pick, I don't need more. I don't know what's going on. Yeah. Have more. Ah! You have more. I guess I should try to empty these before I bring in new stuff. That would probably make more sense than what I've been doing, but... I don't make sense, I make dollars. I'm just saying things in a weird way. I'm not doing an accent before anyone thinks I am. Try not to do that if I can. Since it more often than not just comes out sounding just 
Or is racist. So I need more Basmati in general. One more Basmati, two more spaghetti. Mm, I can take more soup. I don't think it's too soo soo soon for that. Two more penne. more canola and more salt. Oh, you get XP when you buy things too. Interesting. Salt. There was another game that I watched. I would say I watched a bit of it. No, I watched a streamer play like several hours of it. I uh, I don't remember what it's called. I think it's like called like Crime Clean or Crime Scene Cleaner Simulator or something. And uh, it's not Visceral Cleanup Duty. I know or. Whatever that game is called, not that one. I know, I know of that one. That one's just really gross. This one has like an actual story to it. Makes me feel curious. Okay, hold on a second. Hold on. Hold. Uh... You are fluffing butts. I'm going to find thingy. Oh, I'm going to find it. it. Was not long ago. Crime scene cleaner. Okay. It seemed like a really cool game. I didn't expect there to be like a notable story to it, but there is one, and I found myself rather intrigued by the story. So I've just been watching someone else play it. I'm like, I could play it too. I could buy it. It's not incredibly. That is usually the reason why I do not buy things. Oh yeah, I Okay, I need the math. Need two blue flour and um take an olive oil. Two blue flour. peanut butter. Butter. Could do more salt if I wanted. Oh, bread. Bread. I have $15 left.
By master flower and beam flower. Actually, most people seem to buy supreme flower over master flower, for whatever reason. I don't know what difference they're supposed to be. But it'd make a bit more sense if they were like, oh, one of these is whole wheat and one of these is white or something. Or, like, notably different sized packaging or something. I assume it's just like, oh, this is a different brand. I don't want that to be the case for some. Do you take the smaller box out? Oh. Why did I buy so much bread? I must have clicked the wrong thing or something. That's not right. Box? I can't add it to my box for it. Whatever it is, it's in Cyrillic. Which is probably the native language of whatever... of whoever made this game. Because there's some very notable, like... not very notable. There are some minor spelling errors. Not spelling errors. <sighs> what am I trying to... There's some weirdness in how they have worded something. Like, for example, furnitures instead of furniture. And why is the canola oil just oil? I mean, it is an early access. Ooh. Get them one of every bill. If I can, like, give them extra money. I did give him extra money. Did I lose money from doing that? Like, actually? Or did it did it cal calculate that? I mean, I assume it does, but it doesn't mean it's coded in yet. halfway to 14, which is only one level away from 15, which is when we can get a restocker. Don't I have four salt? Five salt. If I throw a box of salt at someone, is it safe to say that they've been assaulted? a battery at them. That is within my power.
That is the weirdest way to get a battery charge I've ever heard of. Officer, I'm innocent! I was just trying to charge my battery! I was given terrible, terrible advice! I gotta say, handing your credit card to someone that they can scan it for you is very much not germ friendly. <laughs> well, it's very friendly to the germs, which is the problem. this page or page I wonder if this game has a page for like suggestions because I very much would like it to not pause while it's in the background Because then I can, like, click on other windows while streaming, which is kind of an important thing to be able to do. Without it, pa without it like, freezing the... not freezing the game, but freezing time in the game. Like a new character model. Ronnie dude. I swear, her shirt is painted on. Oh, right. Looking at boobs too much. I can't help being so gay. Sorry. Well, I'm not, but I could pretend to be sorry. My business is doing so well. Nine PM. We're almost done with it. Just her? Just her. Oops. That was not the right amount of money. She didn't complain though. It's very much not realistic that you shortchange someone and then they walk out. Pretty much always they'll be like, "Hey, you didn't give you didn't give me all my change." 
or they'll like walk out and then walk back in immediately. No one walks out and doesn't come back because like when they knock on all their change. This in my experience is in retail. Yeah, I didn't count shortchanging someone, but I'm de I definitely uh, failed to get to give someone. Pick. Taco pick and no, not cereal. Damn it! What was the other thing? The butter? Oh no! I don't know. Help! I think it was peanut butter. It's already resolved itself. Okay. Deco pick time. a lot of chocolate pick to fill up these shelves. Stuff up. Looks nicer. So I can count better. Yes, I know there's like numbers on it, but Dare they take away my original box for what buttholes? Worked so hard to make that original box for. How dare they? This is. Okay, new peanut butter, one olive oil. One flour. Two flour. Two spaghetti. Not to be confused with a spigot, which is a water thingy. Another susu, and uh, more penne. Another con, uh, another salt. Two more. That's the flour. Ah, uh, let's make it. Oh, I'm buying four sliced bread at a time somehow. That's... Oh, and four chocolate pick. That's why I keep going over. Okay, that makes sense. That's why I like to just hit add to cart as many times as I need rather than changing the amounts, because the amounts don't reset. Which causes issues. I find. Uh, 
peeling up the oil. Yo, gonna oil up the shelves and the customers. It'd be much easier to rob me, though. Very hard to catch an oiled up man. You know, from experience. Just like uh, the, uh, if you can't handle me, if you can't handle me at my worst, then you don't deserve me. Or no, no, not the, uh... No, if you can't handle me at my best, you certainly can't handle me while I'm covered in jam. Very slippery. I love, I love that meme. I think that's right. Might be wrong. Oh, I actually have to put it on there. Rude. So much sea. Outer chicker. In your body for life. Chocked full of microplastics. What about microplasticy goodness? <laughs> Kids love the taste of microplastics. I'm just thinking of, like, horrific ideas for, um, cereal commercials. <laughs> oh, very, very fun. Okay, is there anything else that I could have more? I could get more soul. I could definitely get more canola. Plasma. Uh, Ready for the day. Open my yeah. And my customers can come in and get bodegalicious. However normal people talk. Not that way. Hey, <laughs> in a different way. A lot of paint. Ooh, I like the cyan. See, of a cyan. Like, oh, it's so pretty. Paint in the bucket. True. Throw out the, the buckets. Can't have a bucket in the box for it. That's stupid. Uh, 
by even more. God, the paint fumes would be awful. I, I guess it depends on the type of paint. I've definitely, like, been... Uh, I remember, like, in my childhood house, like, I've definitely been there when there's, like, painting going on. And just, oh, I just remember feeling sick. Of the type of paint they were... Look, I know you're waiting, and I don't care. Oh, especially if you're, especially not if you're gonna do that. Well, okay, that wasn't that, that wasn't that egregious. Paying with a hundred for an eighteen dollar thing is not as bad as many other things. That's at least a notable portion of cost. So happy I don't have to balance, change, drop safe and stuff. Fucking annoying. I understand why. There. And it's reasonable for there, but that doesn't mean it's not annoying to do. I need to finish up soon and get my, myself some thumbs. Any food. Not paint ceiling, got it. Please, oh, damn it, I was worried that was going to. Must paint things. Oh, you can just paint through the shelves. Okay, that works. I guess I could also paint the room over here, but I don't really see a point in doing that. Fills a bit. I've got a good spot to store that. Port behind the cash. I like to believe that there's just like some elaborate cloning experiment going on in this world. And it's all caused by her. She's like the nutty professor in her lab coat. I know it's not exactly a lab coat, but like... Feel like she's a mad scientist. Not sure. I can't, I can't prove it. But it feels like she's a mad scientist. For a second, I thought there was, like, a splash of paint on the wall that, like, I accidentally got on. I was like, no! How did I fuck that up?
always feels weird when people walk around this side. Oh, I'm not sitting up straight enough. Oh yes, some peanut butter for your flour. Exactly what I like to have. Globs of peanut butter covered in flour. Favorite nighttime snack. I guess the more reasonable assumption would be uh, making, making bread and then putting the peanut butter on the bread. But that was way too far from my brain to extrapolate. Look, it's like 9.45, okay? <laughs> Too late for me to... ...braining. You can only brain so hard. Brained so hard and I got so far. But in the end, I didn't brain. The end, I didn't have enough brain matter. Shit, that would be perfect. I mean, as perfect as it can be. Girl, I don't think those heels are doing anything good for your body. They seem like they're fucking up your your posture. Fine, maybe. Like, badly. Yay! Peanut butter and susu. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna need all of this stuff. I know I am. I'm gonna chuck it over. Everything's gonna need to be restocked. I wish this place wasn't outside and, like, you could just get to it through a door. Like, maybe, like, that door, for example. <laughs> that would be nice. That was weird, I couldn't pick that up for a second. Oh, I started reading a new, um... A new, uh, manhwa today. Korean visual novel. Daedalus of the Crow on Webtoon. Pretty cool. Another in the series, or in the genre of gods select humans to do trials on their behalf for greater reward. Yeah. The uh, main character's patron is a crow. A very creepy looking crow, I like him. He's like Helsing Alucard. Crow. Kind of guy. Very fun. I, for those who don't know, I read a lot. I, I read a lot of both manga and manga. 
But I think I have preference to, for manhwa over manga. Just because uh, the way that manhwa is structured leaves a lot of room to have some really, really cool, like, pretty much like tapestries within the comic. That is awesome. I am not familiar with that one. Oh, also, happy birthday! Okay, two olive oil. One peanut butter. Spaghetti. Ubazmaki. Isu and one Chaco pick. Is it... Do you read it on Webtoons or on a different platform? I don't exclusively read on Webtoons, but I do... I do like their platform, generally. Very convenient sometimes. Very inconvenient to other times. Oh! Oh, it's a movie. Okay, okay, okay. okay. I will have to look it up. I am not familiar with it. genre is it, actually? Because if it's like a horror movie, then that's a no-go for me. I'm a scaredy cat. Man. Giant pile of, of pointlessly used cardboard boxes that's like actually working retail. Having the endless supply of cardboard boxes that all need to go somewhere and get recycled and are such a fucking waste. That's fair. I keep thinking of another action thriller, actually, now that you bring it up. I think it's called Unstoppable. Basically, like, about a runaway train. And it's got, like, this really, really, like, aggressively stupid subplot where the uh, main character's like, Oh, man. I'm not, I'm not doing good with my wife anymore. She divorced me, and it's not the same. And he's, like, all pathetic sounding. And then you find out later that the reason his wife divorced him was that she, like, hung out with a male friend and... He went to the guy's house and threatened him with a gun. It's like, yeah, divorcing you was justified, in fact. She shouldn't give you another chance. You don't deserve it if you're going to do stuff like that. That's horrifying. But, like, I just remember that they were trying to push that concept the entire time, just like... Oh, isn't it so sad that he can't see his children? That's because he threatened someone with a gun. Not because he's, like, being deprived. <laughs> I just, just remember that stupid plot and it's been annoying me today. <laughs> it's been in my mind. It's like, why? Why is that supposed to be acceptable? It, it plays so much into the, like, oh, well, he's a man. He can't control himself. Like, oh, my God. What a fucking gross concept. Oh, 
Otherwise, I actually liked that movie. Like, they did, like, tension and stuff really well in that, and, like, I actually did genuinely enjoy it. So, the fact that it had, like, this stupid romance subplot was, like, so frustrating. Because it definitely made the, the, the movie work. I guess I can take more Susu and Pasta if I want. They keep eating up all the uh, flour. I should put some more flour out. I put... Okay, cool. I can put it in here. They keep eating me out of flour. Very disconcerting. Yeah, I need more red flour. And take some more NA. Realistic. Half tempted to like. Half tempted to offer more flour, thing as it seems to get sold pretty quickly too. I don't know. I don't want to move it right now. That's kind of a problem. Kind of a problem for the reorganize reorganizing groups. Wait, this might be the right size for the bread. Is this the right size? Yeah, it's the right size for the bread. Okay. Yeah, I will, I'm fine moving stuff around then. Uh, no. Actually, that's not the right spot. Here's the right spot. It's actually really satisfying moving stuff. Because <laughs> of all the, like, pwah, pwah, pwah. more shelving than I know that I need right now. And I've been wanting to get rid of this white shelving, so I think this is actually a really good time to do so. Because I am under the impression you can sell shelves. Yeah. Yep, that was a hundred dollars. So you get like the hundred dollars for the two side Okay, so you get about half. Of the money back. Okay, that's fair. Okay, I don't like this. There. I want to put that out a bit further so I can see it better. No, oh, come on. Oh, saw it for a second. There's one valid spot here somewhere. There it is. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Just barely. Ooh, okay, so I need three, four more of the blue flower.
this two more of the red one? Unless I have more out there? I do. I'll take one more of the red one. I'll overstock it a little bit. Actually, wait, no, I'm not going to overstock it. I have two two shelves of it. Overstocking it does not make sense. I am going to get that. I am going to put some overstock bread out there. Lots of room. At some point, I will actually want to get another product license, but I feel like I should expand the store first so I can better organize things. Organization is key. I'm sure... I'm sure we've all had that moment where it's like... I can't fucking find anything, because they moved everything in the grocery store. That there. So I can back out of that. That. Cool. Hmm, now that we've expanded, should we go one more day? Or should we call it for today? Yeah, I have been streaming for four and a half hours. It does seem like it is a good chance. Ooh. A good chance to do something else. And by something else, I mean eat and sleep. <laughs> Thank you all for watching so much. I think it is safe to say that this is where we should stop. Halfway, halfway from 14 to 15, then we can have a restocker. Yay. Very excited for that. For those on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you.